This year's SEMA show brought a bunch of wild and impressive concept cars into the spotlight, but the Las Vegas event also had a few weird vehicles on display. Granted, weird doesn't necessarily mean bad, but most of the cars selected for this gallery aren't exactly easy on the eyes. I'm gonna kick things off with a red chubby truck that's as as big as it is ugly. And it's not the extended wheelbase, the six-door configuration, or the raised suspension that makes it unpleasant to look at, but the flashy red paint and the faded gold accents it is finished in. Making things even worse, the wheels combine the same bright hue of red with high sheen chrome. Well, maybe it's not the ugliest truck on the planet, but it's not something I'd like to be seen driving. Not to mention that the raised suspension is pretty much useless on the unbeaten path due to the extremely long wheelbase. Next up, we have Call Racing's engraved Nissan GTR. The GTR is definitely a cool car and its styling is aggressive and good looking at the same time. Unfortunately, Call Racing decided that a supercar would look better with an engraved body painted gold. Sure, the flared wheel arches and the heavily revised bumpers are nice touches, but that finish is a big no-no unless you're looking to sell this contraption to a Saudi prince. Cal Racing isn't the only builder that just unveiled an engraved car. Japanese company Corazon brought a similar project to SEMA, but based on a Subaru WRXT. The Subi is easier to the eye with sterling silver paint instead of gold but it still looks like a piece of furniture instead of an actual car. Other less than usual builds include a strange looking off-roader built around an old Jeep, a Ferrari 458 painted half white half black, and a classic mini pickup carrying wheels on a rack. Okay, I actually like the mini and wouldn't mind having a similar car in my driveway, but the others make wonder if the aftermarket is going downhill.